So at long last, I am doing the yacht missions from GT Online, even though everyone tells me they're bad. I finally grinded enough money to buy the yachts for $3.5 million, because it was half price because of Black Friday. Someone in chat said that I should wait until uh, they're doing triple money for the yacht missions, but it's not about the money. It's about experiencing the content. Where is the phone call from the captain? Call me. We're both Australian men. Should have some sort of telepathic connection. Bitch is ignoring me, man. It's not good. Can I ring him? Possibly. I don't want to appear needy, though. Nope. Can't just call him. Oh! What are the G'day, odds? Boss. This is your captain speaking. Captain Brendan Darcy. Things have been getting pretty hectic on board of late. Thought you might want to swing by. His name is Darcy. That is such an Australian name, even though I've never met a person in real life called Darcy. Darcy is like a name that an American would give an Australian. So this is my yacht, chat. It's huge. I am not overcompensating for anything. Lean on the rail? Wow. This is worth the $3.5 million. Hey, look, guys. The New Zealand flag. Wow. Living the dream. <laughs> yes. Forgot it's called witness protection. I'm funny. I mean, this is probably pretty cheap for a super yacht. A super yacht like this in real life would probably cost a lot more money. Buying people is quite expensive. I own you. You're a part of my yacht. Why is there just a rocket on the ground? Why is there a sniper rifle here? What is that? Why, why is there weapons all throughout my yacht? That's where all the money went, chat. Finding ways to have weapons levitate and spin around. Levitation technology does not come cheap. Hello. That guy sounds really Australian. Where to next, boss? Him calling me boss is not as endearing as Pavel calling me Capitan. Ah, Capitan! You can make the yacht honk from the interaction menu. This was worth $3.5 million. Always got some loose ends, could do with tying up. Of course. Oh, there's a hard mode here, which I will definitely do. Let's go. Fuck, you couldn't have stopped by at a better time, boss. Some bozos snuck on board, snatched the paperwork that classifies us as permanent residents of international waters, go off and take them out. Glad to see you walking a mile or two in my shoes. Seriously, mate. Mate. We're going to get some bozos. Mate. Crikey. Dingoes. Shrimp. Steve Irwin. Subtitles? He speaks perfect English. Just because he's speaking Australian doesn't mean you can't understand him. How dare you insult me this way? Next, you'll be asking for subtitles for things that I'm saying. Take out the Droy Riders. Oh. Don't jet skis. Wait, wait. Is this, it says one's below me here. What? Oh, there's two jet skis here. I guess I'm meant to take these jet skis. It points them out as enemies, but there's no one on them. Ah. Uh. Those shots were perfectly on target, Rockstar. How dare you? Get him this time, chat. I'm so good at this game! And where this other guy is gone, like he's just he's just running. Someone in chat, matter of bad aim. Not at all. Game just robbed me those first two times. Where is this guy? Is that him? Oh yeah, he's shooting at me. He's he's definitely a bad guy. Hey friend. Goodbye. Yeah. Right. Those assholes are all members of the yacht club down at Puerto del Sol. The naval code? Dictates we head over there and put their boats where they belong. At the bottom of the drink. See, when he says bottom of the drink chat, he means like bottom of the ocean, you see? Like the water. He's not speaking about a literal drink. You might you may have not understood that, not being Australian, or just trying to translate, alright? Okay. Bang. Just to be clear, I can't summon my oppressor, right? Can make this quite easy. Vehicles? No. Okay, well. Guess I'll hoof it then. Hoof it is an Australian way of saying, like, running track. Hoot. 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 Boop. Done. I'll lose the cops? Call Lester? Why? Is he lonely? Is he crying? Mission pass. Flawless victory. S+. Plus. Greatest gameplay of all time. Flawless. Jesus, that mug is huge. Live in the high life. Huge yachts. Huge mugs. Other huge things. See what I meant about life on board, boss? I do. That was just another day for Captain Brendan Darcy. Come back oh. and see me again. Or just give me a call. 
He's so needy. And we only just met. Oh, his name's Brandon? Brandon Darcy? Alright, it's a weird name. I've never met an Australian called Brandon in my entire life. Oh, that's why it says B on the map. It's B for boats. Got it. <laughs> Mission number two. Alright, boss. Lesson two in the Brendan Darcy School of Seafaring. There's a supply ship not far from here. It sounds like they're all in the drink. Could be some profitable salvage if you're quick. I was about to say, what the hell is this thing out of the corner of my eye? I've never seen this before in my life. It was mighty convenient that I just happened to be right nearby. Or maybe the captain was the one who sunk him. Hey guys, I'm here to steal all your stuff. You know, just gonna just park this here? Thank you. Got the perfect outfit for salvaging wreckage, obviously. Let's go. My life's not getting any easier. Imagine if one of those lefty politicians stops yachts being a tax write-off. No. Who's gonna buy one when they stop being, well, free for those who can afford it? <laughs> Man. This, uh, Captain Australian guy always complains so much. That's so out of character for Australians, you know. Most Australians, like yours truly, don't complain at all. These guys are misrepresenting us to a global community. I don't like it. You file a formal complaint with Rockstar. Time to get back to the yacht and we can crack open a few. Hey. Few what? Hey, who the hell are you? Oh, no! No, not the captain! These bad guys? Because of you, my yachts are at the bottom of the sea. You take something of mine, I take something of yours. Hey, I own the captain. You can't take him, man. He is a part of my yachts. You can't just take my human property. Okay, just uh, get off this, this this boat here. Okay. Uh, uh, is he gonna fall? You gonna fall? I, uh, okay, that was weird. Hunt, hunt. It. There we go. He can't swim. The fool. Hey, friend. That's the same guy! Someone's down! Someone's down, he didn't even get a name. Uh, not to alarm you, but this would appear to be a teeny tiny hostage situation involving no. yours truly. They've got the bartender too. Some, <sighs> just come quickly. Okay, it's not that far, it's fine. Hey guys, take out the captors. <laughs> <laughs> they were killed? Oh, wasn't as stealthy as I thought. <laughs> Please don't have to do all that again, because that'd suck. Okay, good. So what we'll do is we'll land over here and shoot them all, all stealthy-like, and hope they jump into the ocean. I mean, the people I'm meant to rescue. Obviously, save the bartender first. Oh. I did it. A perfect rescue. Why did I save the bartender first? Uh, all Australians have, like, metal heads and so can survive multiple bullet wounds. Does your foreign biology classes teach you nothing about Australians? And the bartender was French. He probably has like an even weaker head than the average person. I don't know what that means. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. 22 kills for $7,000. Back in my day, kills worth a lot more money. Primarily because money was worth a lot more money back in my day. Don't get kidnapped again. A super yacht life. All hands. We'll be stealing some hands, chat. Lesson three in Captain Darcy's deep water diploma. See, today we're doing a solid for the high and mighty of the Pacific Country Club. It's time to get airborne and put out some flames. Steal the Tula. Oh, I guess this is the Tula. All right. This puppy should get the job done. You can fill her up by landing on water. And then it's just a matter of... Oh, we're putting out fires? Oh, this is a helicopter plane? Bad move. When we're sending a message, you stay out of it or you die. People really like sending messages and not doing things for the money. Oh, shit. Did I get it? You got it. Everything seems to happen at this particular country club. Their insurance premiums must be through the roof. Oh, that's a water tank camera. Interesting. Dropping my hot, wet, salty loads. Okay. I am. Oh, shit. I don't know how much putting out these fires is really helping these cars. 
They still look pretty screwed. And... Okay. Did you get them all? I did. Good work. Thank you. This was an easy one. Last Tuesday, we got boxed in by a fleet of climate activists on sailing skiffs. Wasn't pretty. And I'm not just talking about armpit here. <laughs> This Australian dude is quite funny. That's strange. It is strange, man. I always thought Australians could never be funny. Australians well known for being completely humorless bastards. Fuck them. I say this as Dark Viper NZ. New Zealand number one. We have hobbits. All right, boss. Good to see you back. Head to the frigid warehouse in Cypress Flats. Those money launderers who had the nerve to kidnap me. Of course. I figure, since we're making enemies in that direction already, we might as well make a few bucks, right? A buck is slang for a dollar, chap. If you didn't catch that. We're not doing this for what? Male deer. We're doing it for dollars. If that wasn't clear. These are the aircon units you need to hit. Oh, this is, um, Rocco's place. From single player. He's dead, though, so. Probably not his place anymore. Okay. I was about to say, I wonder if that's gonna explode that. It, it did. It did It did do that. Why is that guy yelling? He's really into his job. Ah! Okay, this, is, this is gonna take a while. Reckon this will make it through? Beautiful. There's another one over there. Okay. One more, which is, uh... Yeah. Uh... No, send... Oh, oh, oh. There's more, okay. Place got a lot of air conditioning. Ah, there's one. I think I was near this one before and didn't notice. You say pooty? What the fuck does that mean? There we go. Okay, motherfucker's one I understand though. In Australian, that means he wants to be my friend. Okay. I have no more heals. Oh no. I have no armor either. And so the game begins. I'll be in a vehicle though, so it won't be that bad. Did you guys know that there's a snowman down here? See, he's right there. Of course you know that, because you've watched every episode of my Facts and Glitches series. I'm sorry for doubting you. I'm sorry for showing you something that you clearly already knew about. It's a Christmas miracle. This being recorded like a week before Christmas. That's vaguely like a Christmas song. You know why I like default to that Christmas song? Because it was the one in Home Alone 2. Hey guys, prologue is the true Christmas movie? Exactly. Hello, Captain. Oh, this is Bon Voyage. Wait, we're saying goodbye to the Captain? Oh, that's, that's probably not what's meant to happen. Or maybe it is. Oh, crap. I think it's impressive that these guys have some sort of weather machine to make it all dark and rainy and stuff exactly when they're invading. That's pretty crazy. Maybe they should have the yacht. Can I just work for these guys? There's a lot of dudes. Get off my ship. Oh, there's more? He's, he's blocking my way here. That's, that's not, that's not cool. What? Those helicopters were already destroyed. Get out of here with that bullshit. This guy wants to take me down, apparently. Didn't achieve his dream. That's me, Dark Viper, the crusher of people's hopes and dreams. You're the last of your kinds. Any last words? Poetic. Okay, there's more. There's usually, everything comes in threes. And this is wave three, so I assume this is the final wave. Oh, good. Let the mopping commence. Got a lot of practice from that janitor mission. In single player. Oh, come on, dude. Oh, then they, then you stop? So I guess that's not the final mission, because we're about to put an end to something. If you could change Brandon's name, what would it be? Uh, I changed to, uh, 
go watch Dark Viper EU on YouTube. Because then everyone would play the missions and then it would say the guest name and they'd be very confused and they'd look up my channel. And then their lives would be enriched by my amazing content. I only think of everyone else. Brings a tear to my eye all the people who are suffering right now, being unaware of how amazing my content is. Just can't help the world, chat. I do my best though. D-Day. The head honcho of that money laundering outfit we've been scrapping with is on some mega secure yacht not far from here. Head over there and get it. We're going down under. <laughs> Get it? He said down under because he's Australian? Very good. I just knew the guy we were up against would be some douchebag with a yacht. Imagine owning a super yacht, chat. Utter loser. Clearly. Release the Kraken. Doesn't mean this is going to be easy. So you can expect mines once you reach the critical depth. Mines? I look so awkward. Oh, there's the mines. I see. It's a good thing they have lights on them so they're easy to see. Imagine the look on all Tell them this is how you spend your time. Most of them just use their yachts for sex, but... Oh. 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 You don't understand what he's saying. That could actually be true for some of you. I wonder to what extent my weird accent is prohibiting me from uh, having a wider audience than I already do. Almost there. Go to the water's surface, close to the yachts. Stay close to the yacht. As soon as he's dead, get out of there. Believe me, you don't want to stick around this crime scene. I don't believe you. I dare you just ask for something like that. Prove yourself. You do be sneaking. Oh, what? How did they see me? I was so quiet. Can you just, can you just get a bullet through here, please? Just one bullet. Uh, the mission bugs? And he died? Dark Viper AU doing speedrun strats without even intending to do speedrun strats. I assume he tried to like take off in a helicopter and he crashed and died. So that's cool. I guess I'm just really scary. Yeah, I thought I had failed for a second there, but uh, yeah, I guess world record for me. Awesome. Is he gonna call and congratulate me or? Well, boss, I'd say your captain's training is complete. Top marks. Best Thanks. In class. I've left a little something for you in your wardrobe. Trust me. You might as well throw away all that other stuff you wear. This guy really wants me to dress up as a captain. He's got that kind of kink thing, I suppose. Whatever. I'm not putting on the outfit. I look too good as is. Can you guys link me a video of the guy I was meant to take out? Because, like, he even says to leave the area. I didn't leave the area, though. Okay, wait. So I guess he was just in this helicopter and the helicopter exploded? And that's, that's the thing I missed out on. So I guess the helicopter just bugged and he exploded. So one thing I do want to do though, is because I succeeded in Keo Perico speedrunning, I achieved my goal. I wanted to get myself some sort of neck chain to commemorate the occasion. Where would I go about buying that chat? Like the best amazing neck chains. All right, Ponsonby it is then. Howdy. How are you? I am good. Pants, pants, pants. Shoes. Accessories. Okay, here we go. You keep typing chains. Where are chains? First one. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, here we go. That's it? Oh, here we go. Hmm. I kind of like that. Just a gold rope chain. Kind of just a... Uh, looks nice, but not too flashy. Obnoxious. There's the word. Oh, gold square kind of matches. I, I like this one so far. Okay, that's good. Gold diamond curb chain. Um, Square versus... Yeah, square's still better. Oh, but just an actual chain? Mm, nah. There's a lot of necklaces. It just says dicks. That's great. Yeah, I like what I have. I like this. Because it just matches the coloring, kind of. Yeah, I like it. Where are earrings? Feels weird not to have ear earrings. I mean, I'm not really much of an earrings kind of person, but for my character, though, yeah, let's get some earrings. Gold diamond studs. Kind of like it. Yeah, I like the diamonds. Gold diamond studs. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I look more flashy, but not too over the top. Is there anything else I'm missing, chat? Other than looking at new shoes. Oh, there's no way I'm gonna wear glasses. Nah, fuck glasses. I got laser eye surgery in real life. Um, I'm not getting Crocs, chat. Is that what these Uggies are? Oh my god, that's awful. Awful. There we go. Look that little bit more extra bling to commemorate my success in Kea Perico speedrunning. How do I save my style, chat? I go to the woman? Okay. This is dumb. Perfect. 
Wait, you know what? Remove my outfit! <sighs> it even brought back my shitty old earrings. Okay, we're gonna, gonna find this stuff again. Let's try again. Edit saved outfits. This is dumb. Perfect. This is... is even dumber. Doesn't fit! Witness protection. Doesn't fit! Swag. Perfect. That ends this episode. Thank you for watching. I hope you're all doing great, and I wish you all the best. Boop.